How's it going guys, James96 here back with another episode of Cave-In. Yes, we're back guys. What is going on? We're already back and it's only been a couple of days. <laughs> Bucking the trend. Yes, we are trying to get uh, some regular recording done on Cave-In again. So, yep, off to a good start. <laughs> two days and the next episode, I think it's two days. But yeah, we are back in our underground village guys. Yes, we are back over here. Thanks for the suggestions last time. We got a couple of great ones from Dan, which I plan to implement. But we are not going to be doing that today. No, what we're going to be doing today is I feel that we need to do some more exploring because there are a couple of areas which I need to find still and we need to go exploring to find them. So, uh, first of all, what we're going to do is we're going to check out uh, how our stock's doing. I haven't done a... Wow, okay. Uh, literally checked a second ago, it was on 64. Uh, and now it's on 64 and 40. That was quick. All right, so that's working really well. So we'll leave 40 in there for now. Uh, we'll get a stack smelting so that we've got some food because, yeah, we don't have any. Um, but, yeah, let's check on KFC as well. See how that's doing. 13 cooked chicken. So we might even might not even need to cook the... Uh, oh, let's not waste it. <laughs> right. And, yeah, I think that's pretty much where we're at with that. Uh, I need to do some AFK fishing, but that's not something we need to show right now. Uh, let's go through here. And we will see how much coal do we have. Yeah, we're doing all right. We need to make some torches because we're going to be exploring. And we know what happens when we don't make torches. Have we got any wood left? I think we might have used the last of it. So we're going to need to grab some wood from somewhere as well. Where am I going to get my wood from? Maybe we'll take a little trip over to the witch uh, area. I haven't shown that off in quite a few episodes episodes now i go over here quite a lot but i don't really show it on camera so you know maybe quite nice to show it off again because i know people have been joining in throughout the series so you might not have seen this uh am i going the right way yeah i am it's this way so yeah uh we'll go over to the witch area to start off with and just do a little bit of afk and just a very little bit just to get a few sticks so that we can make torches i still need to make a tunnel for this i really should do that can't be a. Uh... Yeah, it can't be too far. <laughs> All right, I like this because it's not too far a distance. So yeah, which is actually giving me an idea, but uh, <laughs> I need to check that. So right, let's continue going. I do tend to come up with a lot of my ideas whilst I'm recording, <laughs> so uh, it's quite good. We've also there's probably some wood still around here. I've taken quite a lot of it out. But, yeah, let's go over, jump down. I do love this area. I wish I spent a bit more time over here. I mean, I'd love to. <laughs> if I could honestly turn this into just a continuous series quite easily. There's enough amazing, like, areas in this place to keep me inspired for quite a while. But it's not long now until Exiled, which is, you know, I'm planning to try and wrap up Cave In around the time that Exiled is fully released so that we get a nice turnover. So, for those of you that haven't been to this area before, basically what is happening is uh, just through there is a witch spawner and that's all hooked up so that anywhere I stand in this room I am activating the spawner. The spawner will then take the witches, they'll go along and they'll go up and down and they finish where we were just over there. So, uh, I'm going to AFK for a couple of minutes and I will be back. Okay, so I'm getting bored. <laughs> I've literally been standing here for like two minutes, literally no time at all. We may see a witch come up here, so I'll just stand here for a second just in case one spawns and comes up. So yeah, basically a uh, water stream goes, oh there we go. So the witches float up there and they go all the way up and then they come along and they drop down into here. We've got some hoppers here and then they fill up the chest, but no sticks, damn it. Oh, come on, have some sticks. Damn it. There's so many different drops for witches that uh, the chances of getting what you want are slightly low. So obviously I should be AFK here for quite a while. But uh, we want to get on with the episode so I'm probably just going to knock down a couple of planks from... I just want to see if there's any more that's going to drop. Because even a couple of sticks would be quite nice. Any more? Yeah, that'll do. That will do nicely. Alright. So, yeah, we'll grab a couple of planks on our way back over. 
But yeah, I thought I'd just show that off because we haven't seen that in a little while. So, yeah, uh, that's basically what's going on with that. And yeah, let's continue on going with the episode. So, yeah, like I said, we're just going to be exploring today. So that's a bit of old content, which we haven't really shown off in a while. We're now going to be moving on to new content, which I haven't seen yet. But uh, it's basically from stuff I've heard in my comments and on the forum. Uh, some of them I've been waiting to try and encounter naturally, which I'll explain which one that is in a second. But the rest of it is just stuff that I think I missed whilst exploring. Right, there we go. That'll be plenty. Okay, so let's go back over to the main area to start off with. Uh, whilst we're travelling over there, I think I should uh, mention... Uh, just going to give a shout out to one of the other series I'm doing at the moment which is Final Battleground for those of you who aren't playing it it's by the same or one of the same people that made this map which is Dan Afnus uh, it was also made by Valderock which was one of the first testers of this uh, it's a really good map guys I think you should check it out and uh, I'm start you should check out my series as well there you go there's the link because I'm just starting to get into big builds on that which is uh, very exciting stuff to do so if you like this series you'll probably like Final Battleground it's not too similar which is kind of a good thing it's uh, not part of this map series by the way so Exiled is completely different to Final Battleground Final Battleground is just a standalone thing but it is a good map to play so definitely check out my uh, series on that I might even put an annotation on the screen at the moment but yeah let's get started uh, we're going to start off by going over to the stronghold, more travelling I know, uh, have we got enough stuff, probably good, yep, uh, yes, sure, right, we're going to go to the stronghold because I think I missed an area, well not missed, I uh, on the video I said that uh, I don't need to go to this area because it looks like there's nothing there, which was clearly the wrong thing to do because apparently there is something over there, I have no idea what, it might not even be something over there because uh, it's literally, I haven't checked, and it's based on Dan saying that I uh, counteracted what I was going to say. Uh, I'm just going to chuck up F3 as well, because I'm looking at the biomes to see what's about as we're going over here. Because now that I know the way stuff spawns under the bedrock, I'm thinking if we can find maybe certain biomes, we can get certain materials that we might otherwise not be able to get. I'm thinking mainly snow, because I have no idea how to get snow. And maybe also uh, a lot of sand would be nice. I'm trying to think where I can get sand from. Uh, although I do remember seeing some at the stronghold. So we might be able to get some from there. Because I'd like to get some TNT going. And also some glass for other projects. So yes, that's what we're doing there. We are almost at the end now of the track. It's a long old way this one. Uh, that was a long old episode the journey to the stronghold but yeah let's continue going we're almost there come on I can see the end can't I but yeah definitely check out that uh, final battleground series and also uh, if you're looking for more content from me to look at my Highland series which is a S&P series so obviously playing with a bunch of other people uh, I recently did a prank on a guy called Ecor and his reaction was priceless so Oh, desert. That's awesome. I stopped paying attention to the biome. But yeah, um, yeah, his reaction was priceless. So definitely check that out if you haven't already. Uh, the reaction is also linked in my Highlands video. So you can check that out. But yeah, that's enough of me self-promoting myself. Just uh, filling a bit of time there. Uh, I need to try and find... And I'm probably going to get lost trying to find it. I need to try and find the ravine where we went last time but we didn't actually cross it ah come on there we go ah, and I didn't even want to be in here all right let's continue walking around I might end up doing some jump cutting you guys know the deal uh, if it goes on too long then I will jump cut if not then you get pure content okay so we're back here again all right where could it be uh, maybe down here oh this is what I was looking for all right so I think I know where it is roughly now it's like down this way and yes this is it yeah I think this is it so let's explore around here see if we find anything which we haven't already explored uh, 
have no idea. There's stuff over there though, so we could check out over there. How are we going to get over there? We might need to go back across actually. Let's try doing that. Go up here, go across. Oh, what is it with those spikes today? I don't know what's causing it, just every so often. Alright, we need to get over to there because that looks pretty obviously unexplored. Let's give ourselves some torches as well. Light this place up so you guys can see what's going on. Alright, let's explore around and see what we find. <laughs> Alright, uh, we're going to get lost again. Are we already lost? Hang on. Confusing myself now. Um, we need to back up. It's because I'm trying not to go through these damn doors. Uh, okay, so it goes down there as well. So maybe we should try and get down there. That looks like it's where the party's at. Oh, silverfish. Oh, disappeared. Okay, let's just drop down. Are we safe? Yep, let's continue going. Ah, oh, yeah, there's quite a lot here, which we haven't <laughs> explored. My bad. <laughs> Sorry, Dan. Right, we're exploring it now, though, which is the main thing. Oh, looks like there's a spawner here. I'd rather you didn't shoot me. Come here. Good, you're dead. Ah. Oh. All right. What's in this chest? Buckets, bread, saddle, all the usual. Cool. Let's continue on going. Uh, maybe if we go up this way again. Uh, run around here. I can't run and hold torches at the same time. Which is a shame. We're already starting to run low on torches. And we're running out of space for various things. So let's drop that off. That's the other problem with exploring. Is that you just run out of space so quickly. Have we already been through here? Yeah we have. Okay. Let's continue going this way. Uh, through here. Oh, we've got some gold here. Uh, I'll get that in just a second because it looks like there's a spawn, double spawner here. Come out. Alright, I think we've got it. Probably haven't lit it up very well. Yeah, uh, let's grab the gold. Always use more gold. No harm in getting the gold. Except we're not picking it up because we've got too much stuff. We don't need eggs. And uh, we don't need feathers. So we've got the chicken KFC that will deal with that. Let's take that. Don't really need the string anyway. Uh, let's continue going up. Oh, looks like there's something up here. Let's go up and see what we find. Aha! So, it's a custom area here. Uh, I think we're safe. Yeah, safe enough. No player will ever escape our domain. No player will ever escape our domain. Archimedes is no more. Other fools be warned. Okay, so <laughs> that's uh, interesting. So, no player will ever escape our domain. Archimedes is no more. Other fools be warned. Damn, sounds like Archimedes got killed. That's not good. Because we're meant to be trying to escape. And if he couldn't make it. Who's that speaking to us? Okay. <laughs> Damn, that adds a new layer to the uh, storyline. <laughs> okay, I can see why that's important now. Damn. So, uh, I think we've explored. Let's just check around. Uh, I don't have any more torches, though. But yeah, I think we've explored most of this now. Damn, so Archimedes has uh, died. So now we've got to try and do what he couldn't. And Archimedes is a clever one here. If you check out his base, it's pretty awesome. Right, so <laughs> now that I've uh, worried about that, where are we? how do we get back out? Okay, let's, where, where was it? Where was it? Aha, that looks good to me. Let's jump up here. Try not to die on the lava. It's always good. Um, 
How do we get here? We got here from through here. So it's a little way to get here. Um, not the most natural. But then I suppose you don't want to hand feed us everything. So. Alright, uh, where are we going to go next? We need to try and get out of here now and get back to where we were. So I think if we go... Right, I'm going to show off my good directional skills here. Because it's uh, this way. Then this way. Oh, look at that. He's found it straight away. I am a pro. Let's eat some of our Kentucky Fried Chicken. Alright, cool. Now, let's continue. Uh, I will do a quick jump cut and I will see you in a second when we're back over at our main base. And we're back over at the main base now. So let's drop off some stuff so that we can go explore our next area of the day. Area number two. So uh, let's drop off some stuff. Uh, let's drop this off in the furnace. That seems a safe place to put it. <laughs> Uh, we're just going to dump the rest of it somewhere. We're running so low on chest, place, chest uh, space. But hopefully quite a lot of this should fit in. I'm just going to spam all of these, see if it will accept any of them. Okay, so we got rid of quite a lot of our stuff there. Let's do the same here. Okay, that didn't work too well. Uh, I think I should be able to put that in here. Let's dump these in here. Oh, we're running so low on available. Okay, we've got some chest space here. We really need to sort it out. I might do that in between episodes. Uh, yeah, we've still got everything that we need, I think, except torches have disappeared. Uh, oh, we ran out of torches, didn't we? Let's just take four. Running low on coal again. Hmm, not good. Okay, um... So we've got some torches there. And... It's never good when you don't have torches when you're doing a cave exploration episode, is it? Uh, but yeah, I think we've dropped off everything that we need. So, let's move on to our next area. So, this basically is the one which I've heard about and I've seen mentioned on people's videos. And some people seem to find this area straight away, which I don't really understand. Because uh, eventually someone told me how to find the area. And by the sounds of it, like there's no logical way to get there. So... Basically, obviously, I've done some building, but it's in one of these normal mine shafts, and I think it's this one. And you just have to like dig down here, and then you find a tunnel. But like, how? Oh, there's a creeper there. How are you meant to find that without knowing to look there? That's what I want to know. Because I mean, we'll have a look around and see if there's any more caves leading off, I guess. But like, how are we meant to find that? Aha, coal. We should grab this. Just a few pieces. Because we don't have that much, uh, many sticks anyway. We've only got one stick, so there's not much point grabbing any more of this coal for now. But at least we know where some is. Right, so... Yeah, I think it's around here. Aha. Yep, here we are. This is what I was looking for. I think we found, if I'm not mistaken, I think we found our bat cave. Which is awesome. Love the look of this area. Look at it. <laughs> Looks so cool. Uh, just going to try and light up as much of this as I can. Yeah, look at it. Looks really cool. <laughs> They've done a really good job with this area. I mean, it looks like a proper cave. I presume it's bat spawners up there. Yeah, it is. You can tell. And yeah, this area looks really, really cool. So yeah, the only downside with it is I don't really know how you're meant to get to it without knowing where to go. But yeah, apart from that, oh, look at that. Power three, I'm breaking free, punch one bow. That's awesome. Uh, I might try and repair that one. So yeah, let's continue looking around. Uh, I see a couple of chests up the top there, so I want to check them out as well. Um, keep looking. Just want to make sure that I light up the whole area well as much as I can but yeah look at it it's really nice and uh, also it's a way of getting vines so yeah we will be able to get some vines from there and we can grow them on our jungle wood as you know you don't have to have jungle wood do you it's emerald there let's grab that and just check there's nothing up here like I said I'm just looking for ways that you could possibly like naturally find this Oh, MC edited water. 
Maybe. <laughs> hmm, interesting. Is there anything else up here? No, that looks like it. Okay, let's continue going back. Oh. <laughs> Hello. Just sitting there in the middle of the uh, thing. That's why it pays to have your head down sometimes. Alright, we found another diamond. It's always useful. Right, let's check out these chests then. Because I've been looking forward to checking these out. Trying to hold back, make sure I explore the full area first. <laughs> Tons of bats. If I had infinite amounts of name tags, I'd probably name some bats. We got some bat spawn eggs, interesting. <laughs> bat mask, bat shirt, bat pants, bat boots. We could be Batman, yes. <laughs> Batman. Batman, yeah. <laughs> that is awesome. That actually looks really good. On a, I might have to invest in making leather armor more. Or something that actually look more often. That actually looks really good with my skin. I think personally. Let me know if you like the look. But yeah, uh, that's cool. Uh, was there? A, I think there were more spawners up here. Maybe. Oh, bother. Uh, there we go. All right. Um, there's another chest up there. Yeah. Cool. Oh, that's cool. I'm happy now. I get to be Batman. I don't think it'll provide the same protection, but it's worth it. Guano? Is that like Spanish for... Um, I'm probably being an idiot here, aren't I? Uh, but yeah, that's cocoa beans. I don't know why they're called guano. Interesting. Alright, uh, let's continue on. Let's go back. And we've got one more area which I want to explore today. Lots of exploring, guys. Uh Obviously, we're getting near the end of the series now, so we're just trying to blast out these last three exploration bits that we covered that. Then we'll wrap up the last few projects that we got. So, yeah, the only one of the few flaws I found with this map is I have no idea how you're meant to get to that area. I think they might have fixed that, though, in a later update. Not entirely sure. I think they were talking about it, but that was a while ago when that kind of was being talked about in the forums. Back when... Uh, <laughs> That was still back when I was the only person recording. But uh, now there's quite a few people doing series on it. Oh, those were the days. Only joking. Right, uh, let's continue on. <laughs> uh, and the last area, I'm trying to think where it is. I saw this a little while ago whilst I was checking to see if there was any wood around in the um, in the mine shaft that we've got just here. But I'm going to take a uh, wooden sword with me uh, not wood, golden sword with me actually that's probably not going to do a lot let's grab a what's that crap uh, terrible I'm not going to say there you go there's the silverfish sword so if we put that here we can use that because the next area is covered in cobwebs so I didn't get into it uh, I'm not going to take a water bucket with me, but it would make sense to. I just don't have one to hand. Unless there's one in one of these chests. We've got loads of buckets, but we don't have any water. So let's leave it. It's not that much of an issue. So I think this last area is over this way. No, it wasn't that way. Uh, this way? Have we got any torches left as well? No torches left. Damn it. Uh, was there any sort of wood around? Oh, there is some wood. I obviously didn't pick it up because I wanted to explore it. That is awesome. <laughs> well, not awesome that I haven't been using these resources the whole time, but awesome in the fact that I can uh, use them now. We've got like no torches because I didn't pick up any of that coal really. Should have picked up a bit more. Anyway, right. So, this is the area. I've, this may just be a cave spider thing, but it looks like it was quite expansive. So, hopefully, it's something more. Yeah, it looks like it's something. Okay, so we've got a spawner up there. What are you spawning? Cave spider baby zombies? Oh, okay. Yeah, I'll believe you. Okay. <laughs> oh, God, this is a nightmare. Got a potato. Don't really need one in this series anymore. Oh, God. Right, this could be an issue. I need to stop. Wow, they pack a punch. Alright, this could be fun, I guess. Uh, let's try and get some light in there. So you guys can see what's going on. Sorry if that was a bit dark just now. Probably was, wasn't it? Alright, let's try and... 
Do I want to disable the spawner or could I try and find something? Um, let's keep our options open. I don't think I'm going to need to. Ah, uh... oh, no. They dropped down so quickly. Okay, this could be an issue. I'm going to be down to half a heart. Alright, let's block off this area so that I know I'm safe. Then let's grab some blocks <laughs> so that I can sort of have myself protected if I need to. Alright, let's try this again. I need to try and clear out enough area that I can torch up the whole place so that no more will spawn. Once we can stop the spawning, we should be able to get these last few cave spiders. This guy's going to cause me problems, isn't he? I don't want to get caught in the webs either. That's the other thing I've got to be really careful of. Okay. Uh, yeah, so like that, basically. That's the worst case scenario. Oh, sorry if you heard that. A little notification going on next to me. Oh, I'm on half a heart, so it's probably best not to try and <laughs> go in just yet. Uh, the amount of times in this series when I've been on half a heart is frightening. Oh, but we still have zero death guys, zero deaths guys, so we will keep that going till the end. We've got two big challenges left in terms of that, which is the Wither fight and the Ender Dragon fight, which we will have to do both of those soon. So we've got those to look forward to. Look forward? Is it looking forward to ready? But I don't know. But yeah, I wouldn't necessarily say I'm looking forward to them. Right. Okay, we got that guy killed. Is anything else going to spawn in? Does that continue that way? Are we safe now? I want to just check that out as well. No, it looks like we're safe. I wonder why that does that. Is there a reason for it? No, it doesn't look like it. I'm going to be annoyed if there is something behind that, but I'm sure someone will tell me if there is. Black Banner, White Skull Charge, and Come To Us. Dot, dot, dot. I may have done some of these out of order as well, so that is probably referring to one of the other areas. But cool. Alright, so we've had <laughs> a pretty productive episode actually. We got quite a lot down. Uh, down? Done. So that's always good. I always like it when we get a lot done uh, in terms of our episodes, progress wise. So let's maybe hang that on the wall here. Actually, I'd quite like to put that one high. Can I not break that now? I can. There we go, that's where I want it. And then we're going to stand next to it. So guys, yep, that is all we've got time for for today. If you enjoyed the episode, please leave a like. And if you haven't already, please subscribe. And let me know in the comments what you thought of this episode. And I will see you next.